Hey guys, what's up? Scott here from Flash Labs, and today I have an unboxing for you of the XFX Radeon HD 6850. Uh, this will be the new graphics cards card that will be used in my uh, new Sandy Bridge i5 2500K build. Uh, on doing this, waiting on the new uh, Revision V3 mother or uh, Cougar Point chipsets from uh, Intel to be. Uh, shipped out. Um, I actually, they're actually shipped out. I'm just waiting for the companies to fix them and then start shipping their products um, before I end up buying the rest of the stuff. But this had a, it was really, it had a thirty dollar rebate. So I just thought, hey, whatever, I'll pick it up. So this card has HDMI, dual DVI and display port, which I'll be using display port on my monitor. Uh, I'll probably be using DVI at first, just do. I'll need to go out and uh, pick up a new uh, display port cable as I don't have one. So right there, as you can see, you have the key features. It is PCIe 2.1, Microsoft Direct X. It has iFinity, which I unfortunately don't have enough monitors to take. Uh, advantage of uh, parallel processing technology. I don't know what that is. Crossfire, and I am thinking about picking up another one of these uh, later down the road and just running these in Crossfire for uh, better performance. Uh, uses uh, AMD's uh, 40 nanometer process technology for making the actual GPU, and it is 3D uh, compatible with the HDM. HDMI 1.4 support and right down here, no, it looks like they threw on a sticker saying that uh, it's stereoscopic 3D. So I'll just take out my knife here. Sorry, can't even see that. And I will open that up. I'm going to break the seal there. And I'll admit XFX has wonderful packaging. Um, I have a few other things that I received from Newegg where I got this today. I got an XFX Black Edition Power Supply, which I'll be uh, posting a video on later. And some RAM, which isn't too exciting, but I'll probably just open it up. So, as here you get a box inside a box, which uh, is pretty standard from XFX. Right here you just have their logo and uh, their website. So I'll just open this. Awesome. So they have their little Pro Series. Got that in there. Pro Series PSUs. And I didn't know that XFX made PSUs until maybe about a month ago. Um, and the PSUs are actually based on Seasonic uh, modules. So you're, you already know they're going to be pretty good. Little warranty pamphlet. Just explains the warranty. Quick installation guide. You have your driver's disc. As I will say, you always want to throw out this and download the latest from XFX. or not XFX.com, sorry. You want to go to the uh, AMD Radeon site and download the latest drivers from there because the ones that they send in here are usually out of date. Uh, you have your little on gaming, do not disturb door hanger. And I actually think that's pretty cool that they include that in there. It also has your uh, serial number and your part code on there in case you ever have to call them for support. And then, let's see what's in this little box. If I can figure out how you open it. There's nothing. I don't know why they have a little box there, but they do. And for the card itself. Comes neatly packaged in a anti static bag. Now, I'll be honest, this is my first graphics card, as it is my first uh, raid that I've ever built myself. So, I'll just take that out of the packaging here, a little anti static bag. And there she is. That is beautiful. Have a very nice. Uh, Cooling shroud on it with a, it looks like about a 92 millimeter fan on there. Uh, direct contact 
heat sink with what looks like to be one copper heat pipe that's cooling the uh, memory modules on it. And I guess this is called a flower heat sink, I didn't know that until recently. So looking at the back of this, it looks like there is a, this is a reference card, so it is a reference card, and up top here you have your little crossfire bridge connector. Uh, you got the ports here. You got your uh, dual DVI, HDMI, and display port. And your single six pin power connector over on this side. So, when I get the rest of my system put together, I will be making a performance video on this card. Uh, it's very nice looking for what I can tell so far, and I've heard great reviews about it. So, I will see you guys in the next one.